Ty Campbell at Teakin Racing here, and in this video, we're gonna cover the setting brake minimum, specifically what it does, how you can use it, and how to adjust it. The brake minimum setting on Tekken speed controls changes the percentage of brakes that you get the instant you actually get into trigger brakes. So the default is actually zero. It's not gonna affect anything. You can go from zero all the way up to 30%, so say you want 15% brakes the instant you get into trigger brakes, you set brake minimum for 15, apply the settings, and then as soon as you touch trigger and get into brakes, you get 15% right off the bat. Now keep in mind, this is actually going to change the way that your brakes are on your trigger. So if you're starting at 15%, as soon as you move off neutral into trigger brakes, you're going to get to 100% quicker, so it changes the brake throw. So keep that in mind. Where do you wanna set brake minimum? It's one of those settings that is up to you. And honestly, I suggest just playing with it to figure out if you even like it or not. There are some times where I think a higher brake minimum or initial brake would be beneficial, such as modified off-road on carpet or astroturf or touring car on a really sticky asphalt track or on carpet as well. I don't like to run any brake minimum. I just leave my stuff at zero. The only time that I have run brake minimum was on a really grippy off-road AstroTurf track. Brake minimum can only be adjusted through the Hotwire app on PC or an Android or Apple device. So let's plug into the PC real quick. We'll check out brake minimum. Brake minimum is available on the brake tab in the Hotwire. It is the fourth setting from the left, this guy right here. The default is zero. You have zero all the way up to max, which is 30. So pick the setting that you would like to use and hit apply settings to save them to your ESC. 